Well, with a government shutdown pending, we are checking on what impact that would have on border security and the backlog in immigration court. At 4 o'clock, KPRC2 investigator Robert Arnold explained a shutdown would mean tens of thousands of Border Patrol agents and office of field operation officers would be forced to work without pay. Well, Robert is back with us now on how this may impact immigration court. Robert. This has the potential to have a severe impact on a system that is already experiencing an historic backlog. Here's what we're talking about. About. There are currently 2.6 million cases pending in immigration court, with the average case pending in court for 632 days. And to give you an idea of the backlog locally, we spoke with the veteran Houston immigration attorney about how far out hearings for some of his cases are being scheduled. Just to give you an idea of how backlog the cases are, uh, our most recent ones were 2025. Now we have received a few hearings already scheduled for the year 2027. Now, if the shutdown does happen, cases involving detained migrants will still move forward and attorneys can still file paperwork needed for their cases. But hearings for cases involving non-detained migrants will be canceled and will have to be rescheduled. How far out these cases will be rescheduled will depend on the length of the shutdown, which will ultimately impact the backlog overall because Border Patrol would keep working during a shutdown just without pay and new cases would be added to this system. Live in the newsroom, KPRC 2 News.